Virgo, welcome back to the channel. This is Kelly from House of Virgo. Um, we're going to do your weekend reading here. This is going to be a little quick tonight because I already uploaded your weekend video. This is the second one I'm doing because YouTube has restricted and blocked my video again. Okay, so let's just get into this. Everything you need to know, booking readings, follow me on Facebook, social media stuff. Um, everything's in the description box below and please do Put a like and smash that subscribe button if you enjoy the readings and hi everybody in the chat okay so ten of swords um virgo looks like you're done you're hitting rock bottom over the weekend you're surrendering to something or someone is surrendering to something over the weekend okay queen of cups cancer scorpio pisces this is like there's no way to go here but up okay somebody someone has just given up or surrendered okay to their feelings and to the conflict i feel like um over this weekend there's an energy of like yo i'm done fighting i'm not gonna fight anymore i'm giving up i'm surrendering taking a look at how one feels tired of competing tired of the challenges and all of the drama okay so if there was like some kind of battle or something um, that you find yourself in over the weekend or if there is with a water sign um, or you know one of you or both of you is just going to be like you know what you can have at it you win I'm fine it's it's like I'm not going to argue I'm not going to fight somebody wins definitely some kind of an argument or a position and I feel like this energy is going to happen on Friday okay let me see what else yeah and then the moon okay I feel like Virgo, I don't know who it's going to be, but there's just an energy of like this whole situation. Um, there's not, feels like, I don't know if there was lies or if there's like um, deception or just some vibes. I feel like somebody's just like throwing their hands up in the air and waving them like they just don't care. That could be you. It could be another person. Um, also Cancer or a Pisces. Like I did say there was water energy here. There's fire and air as well. So it looks like Friday is like more along the lines of there's a, some type of conflict and it's just like, you know what? You can win, you can have it. Uh, somebody just says, I'm, I'm not fighting. I'm done with it. I'm, I'm not gonna argue about this or I'm not gonna pursue, I'm not gonna push. I'm just giving up, okay? So that's Friday. So at least something gets nipped in the bud here. Now for Saturday, Okay, Seven of Swords. I don't know if you guys can hear my grandson in the background. He's singing. <laughs> okay, so yeah. I feel like Saturday is kind of an energy of like somebody wasn't committing because there was deception or there's some type of lies or somebody ghosts and there's just an energy of sneaking away. Someone's being very strategic and kind of sneaking away. Oh can't with us this king of swords seriously who is this you know when i first started my channel it was non-stop the emperor was showing up all the time now the king of swords is here so i feel like there's some clarity somebody has clarity or somebody's just in this position of being like you know dropping some truth bomb or um hmm I don't know who this is. I feel like there's something that goes on along the weekend between you and another person where either, you know, there's there's arguments about deception or someone being uh, maybe stealing something or being dishonest or running away or sneaking away. Yeah, oh my gosh. Yeah, the Five of Pentacles. It's like, um, it feels like, I, I don't know if you're being accused of this or, or you're accusing somebody else or something comes up over this weekend you know Virgo where it's and this is nothing like the reading that uh, the reading that I did earlier was more about you just kind of going in hermit mode and just saying everybody just leave me alone you just want to be alone you're not feeling well maybe this is a little bit more to it if they un if they unrestrict the video I'll post it um but it, like if they don't block it, I'll post it. Um, I did like an appeal to try to get them to like stop doing that to me, but you know, definitely something comes to an end for, like fully. Um, and it doesn't necessarily mean like a relationship comes to an end. It's just like, I just hear someone say, you know what, I've had it, I'm tired of this. This weekend, I don't wanna deal with this. And so somebody tries to communicate over the weekend and then there's some type of, you know conflict that arises from that 
and you know Friday and Saturday it could be like the conflict starts Friday evening and goes into Saturday morning and there's some back and forth communication or texts or um, sitting in front of each other having an argument it's like it's done I don't want to talk about this anymore um, you know that death card is always like a big change and ending someone's in like this time to move on and um, just get out of the situation or you know stop talking to each other or just disconnect over the weekend okay so let me see what Sunday brings for you Virgo okay Sunday's better we've got the Sun so much more positive energy for Sunday for sure this is like getting a breather I feel like there's an energy of two people having some kind of an argue, argument or conflict and um, basically just saying you know what let's let it rest then we're not going to be able to resolve this if we're angry at each other Sunday looks like some truth comes out okay some clarity and it's something to do with this five of swords energy it's something to do with um, maybe a, a sense of like a, an unhealthy relationship unhealthy communication there's clarity um, there's some kind of victory and wow I do feel like something starts up again here where there's communication but it's a very positive um, it's like being able to start over and healing this thing and with the world is like making this change here you know um having a new start initiating a like everybody clear the air like okay clear my head clear your head um let's separate let's let it rest let everything die down over this weekend just remember it doesn't have to be with um, a romantic partner it could be with a friend or a family member and um there there is somebody that does want to initiate communication to try to talk again in a positive way but another person might not be ready with that four of swords can just be like not answering um retreating not saying anything okay so there might be some communication like over the internet or <clears throat> through the phone or something like that okay sunday's like okay <clears throat> wow my goodness hold on I feel like one person wants to talk and try to resolve it and another person is basically like no I don't want to talk right now no I need a little more time to just you know I'm on R&R &R right now I'm, my phone like it's off the hook somebody's not answering the call okay so Virgo if that's you trying to initiate a conversation to try to resolve something with someone and they're not ready to talk then you know just leave it be okay and if they ghost you and they don't answer the phone uh, like I don't ever feel like that's healthy I feel like it's healthier if like one person who doesn't want to talk just kind of says you know what I need a little more time just to chill just to recollect and um, I'll call you back a little bit later but if someone just doesn't or just blocks like I mean that's just immature it's just very immature and if you are trying to initiate talk to someone and they're not and they're not even giving you the courtesy to say hey you know what I know we had this argument last night or whatever happened and um I just need a little time then if somebody doesn't do that then like that should be a big red flag to you Virgo I feel like you need to know that and um, if, if they're reaching out to you to try to talk it would be best for you to just give someone a heads up and say you know I'm still upset I'm still clearing my head okay so let me see what else can you tell Virgo about Sunday this video is going to be so fast and so you might get a double tonight so we'll see how that goes what else can does Virgo need to know about Sunday <laughs> can hear him Sunday okay oh one card flipped out I saw it real quick let me see here it is okay yeah nine of Pentacles so Virgo it kind of feels to me like there will be communication the nine of Pentacles is just like somebody just wants to be by themselves okay there will be communication to try to um, reconcile try to talk either you'll call them back or they'll call you back or uh, there will be that energy okay um, but I feel like there may be an energy also like coming in really fast and another like somebody else is kind of like blocking like um, 
they don't want to talk fully just yet. I feel like someone's very hesitant to um, somebody doesn't want to get back in. They, they have some boundaries up. That could be you, um, whomever it is, has some boundaries up and is going to deflect a lot. Doesn't because there's hesitancy of, you know, don't want to split up or don't want to be separated, but don't want to jump back in because there's there was like some big conflict. And conflict could have had to do also or has to do also with a lot of other people. There could be family members involved or work colleagues um, or, uh, you know, other third party situations. Yeah. So I kind of feel like the energy is like, OK, don't want to disconnect. But, you know, this is somebody's kind of like wants to does is going to block the burden of um yeah it just feels like very deflective energy somebody doesn't want the whole burden if there's a conversation and you feel like somebody's trying to put all the blame on you i feel like you're going to deflect it or if you're trying to put the blame on somebody else like i mean obviously virgo that's not a that's not a um it's not what they call like a conflict resolution conversation that's more like a blame conversation and that's just making things worse so you know if somebody's doing that to you there might be a reason why you're like oh i feel it and it's starting up again and i'm not getting into this again and then retreating and vice versa okay um conflict resolution conversations are generally like yeah that argument we had um you know i, I want to take the blame i want to take accountability for the things that i said and and you know it, it's more apologetic to both people coming in humbly you know and um trying to find a solution let me see what else does virgo need to know for this weekend what an interesting weekend it might be best for you to be in hermit mode all weekend virgo and like but even then, oh my gosh, if you're in hermit mode or somebody else is in hermit mode, not talking, that could instigate because somebody's not replying and that could instigate the conflict. I don't know. You know your situation much better than obviously I do. But I feel like any conversations that are going to be had need to be healthy. If not, keep it moving. Yeah, because it's like, no, we're seeking peace, peaceful resolution. That's what you are looking for or will be looking for. And that's what this person is looking for. So if there's any energy that you feel is coming up where you and another person start talking and then it starts getting hated again, then that's how you know that one or both of you are not ready to resolve the problem. Okay, and it's best to just take a time out and keep taking a time out until it's sorted out internally. Okay, because I, I just kind of get a feeling that someone does, you know, not want to lose the other um, and not have a breakup, but it's it might just be reconnecting and then rehashing the same old thing again, and it's like no, I'm not participating anymore. Yeah, okay, what else? I feel like they're gonna keep telling me the same thing, but I'll pull a few more cards. Okay, yeah, look at that, Four of Cups. Yeah, they keep telling me the same thing. So this is really just like, you know, this this conversation is becoming unfulfilling. And it's just, I'm feeling kind of apathetic and indifferent toward it at this point. You know, um, might be too soon to talk, might be too soon to reconnect with someone. So what's the advice i mean obviously the 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 obvious advice feels like to just leave it be and let it sort itself out till everyone's like in a calmer place but what does spirit want to tell you that your advice is okay um hmm. so hierophant in the reverse so basically um this is like kind of detach rebel go go your separate ways um just that this i feel like it the message here is take a breather um walk away from the situation king of cups ten of cups okay um somebody here very deep in their emotions for you and you know your marriage your relationship your kids um if that's not your situation it's just like your relationship in general there's somebody here definitely who wants to try to push the envelope and try to bring things back together and it feels like maybe it's you virgo who um i don't know virgo there's a little you know there's conflict i don't know i i too i do see two people not wanting to give up i just feel like there's a struggle in communication here wanting to clear the air and have some victory but then yeah somebody's not fully ready to talk 
just yet. So if that's this person here, um, just give them more time. Um, if it's you, tell them you need more time. All right, I just feel like you gotta check. I just gotta check. It, what it, Show us something good for Virgo, what, something good. I mean, this is, uh, it's a reading is a reading. Okay, good, Virgo. It looks like with the hangman, you're gonna get an opportunity. If you take some time to like, kind of just dis disengage, pull away, um, and, and this person does, I feel, I love the hangman because this is like seeing the situation with a new set of eyes. That, that needs to happen, okay? Because there's something here about getting caught up in the, oh, just the the tidbits of of everything and the and the the tit and tat kind of energy um i feel like it's just time to step back you'll need to step back both of you and just kind of take a breather take a break that hangman energy is always about you know gaining some wisdom and getting a different perspective on something now listen <laughs> when i'm talking about if somebody was cheating or sneaking out or sneaking around there is no other perspective i mean <sighs> The perspective might be like, why am I arguing with this person when they're sneaking around and cheating and lying and or they stole from me? Like there's, you can understand why somebody, maybe they're poor and they don't have any food so they stole a loaf of bread. Or, you know, maybe they just got caught up and made a mistake and they went with somebody. Well, that's not a mistake. That's like intentional. But if they were drinking or whatever, it was just immature and irresponsible type behavior. The, the, the different perspective for someone here might be more along the lines of like, maybe I need to stop looking at this in the light that I'm looking at it and actually see it from a different light, right? Maybe I need to like pray a little and kind of like ask spirit for some guidance here to give me a different angle on, you know, what I'm actually dealing with here. Like what, what is this person? What is this situation? Um, you know, like what really is it? Uh, I don't know. I feel like it's, it might be something more than what you think. I don't know. You might be judging the situation or looking at someone or, or both of you might be looking at this relationship is that, you know, hmm, and maybe there's some serious issues here that someone is kind of glossing over. So yeah, happy weekend, Virgo. I mean, listen, if anything, if you get into some kind of conflict with some people or a person, you know, um, this is your preparation. You might already feel this coming. And the message here is don't get into any drama. Don't get in it, into it with anybody. Just space, lots of space, get some distance, separate, spend a little time on, on your own, let them spend a little time on their own. Um, unless there's an actual, okay, we'll sit down and resolve the problems in a healthy way. If that shows up, that's awesome. But if that does not show up or it does and it starts getting heated again, out the door right? All right, Virgo, I'm going to leave that there for you. I hope you had a fantastic weekend and I hope this doesn't get blocked. I'm about had it with <laughs> YouTube. I don't know what's going on. So yeah, have a great weekend. I'll see you all back here on Sunday, right? Take care. <music>